Warning, the following contains material that may be too disturbing to some people. Descriptions of violence, mature situations, and adult themes. This is intended for mature audiences. Your discretion is advised. We are live. Welcome to Megawatts Hornets. Yeah, had it ready. An unknown time. army's story. All right. You may be thinking, wait, <laughs> this isn't unknown army's week, and you would be right, and you would be wrong. Uh, uh, if you were living in the past, you would be correct. But in this new future, every week is unknown army's week. Except That's next right. week. Except for next week, we're go we're we're off next week for uh for things. But in the twentieth. <laughs> oh no no no! Next no. week, the thirteenth. The thirteenth, we're on. Oh, we're on the. T we're on. We're the thirteenth. We're off the twentieth. Oh there. oh right. oh. Okay. Pardon. Okay okay. I got ahead of myself. All right, it's fifty fifty points minus from House Sarah. All right uh. <laughs> My DKP. Hey. Yes, your DKP. Your <laughs> precious, precious DKP. Um. Anyway, now we get to see more of this group as they try to conquer all of the challenges that are laid before them. So, who has any uh, recap for what happened last session? Oh, we sort of robbed a clock museum. Sort of robbed, defined, <laughs> sort of robbed. Very thoroughly, effectively robbed. <laughs> yeah. Uh, definitely didn't end up in a fight with the guards or anything. Everything went to plan. Nobody got tied up and left at their house with their memory wiped. Um, none of that stuff. It was all just really smooth. And we got all the things we needed. <laughs> no, he didn't say that. Okay. Right. No, we don't know what yet. Yeah. Um, so, also... We met some, uh, I guess, other characters that we haven't seen on this this show so far, like some of the other players, other characters, right? Yes, we introduced Sarah Bess, one of Steph's old characters. Invisible lady. She ran away. <laughs> she what? She ran away. She stole the security guard's gun, like, right in front of us while we were pulled out of the car for loitering. <laughs> and smoking doobies while playing Led Zeppelin in the parking lot. And and making out. There was definitely making out oh, in yeah. that car. <laughs> I forgot it's totally illegal to make you out were, in the car. You were, you were, you were a, a degenerate teenagers <laughs> in the car. And uh, in in order to avoid it all being pinned on you, you have successfully pinned it all on oh, yeah. at we... the one hyper competent guard who nearly spoiled everything for you. <laughs> I forgot we pinned it all on him. Yes, I am sure, sure, a hundred percent sure that nothing bad will come of this. I was right? saying this man's gonna track you down Better and kill you all. I not. can smell it. Better mm. not. I got a critical success. Got a critical success on what? That's that's what call. On that's what mind uh, swipe. Okay, yeah, sure. That's sure. That's what going out with a bang is, girl. That's. <laughs> did did we camera swipe 
Did we we had Epo yeah, you with definitely us. camera wiped. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, I hope. What it... I'm saying, what I'm saying I... is not that not that the police are going to come after you. Oh. Not the police. It's always somebody Don't else. Worry. Don't worry. You are not the only group around here. All right. There may be others. Fantastic. You have. You have made a big ripple here, all right? This is a thing people are going to notice, all right? This is not some minor shit happened. This is major heist at a clock museum. (laughs) (laughs) It's basically Ocean's Eleven. Listen, they shouldn't have posted a goddamn tour on the internet, right. okay? Absolutely. Oh, <laughs> yeah. that, that they might shouldn't have, been sho- have tried to keep was, business that, going during a pandemic. <laughs> that <laughs> might have been the shocking content, us sitting there. <laughs> They're like, no, you can't go through a virtual on tour stream. on your stream. <laughs> you, were, you were one sentence away from being banned. <laughs> Actually, you said the sentences I thought would be you get you guys banned. <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, <laughs> please don't ban me. Twitch, YouTube, please. I'm just please, a baby. Okay. I'm just a baby. He's <laughs> <laughs> just a baby. The stream's only a, like a year old. He's just a baby. He's just a baby. It's a very big baby. Anyway, so I am guessing, Steph, that Cerebes has wandered off. Or is she going to try to come on back and do them? Or is she going off on her own? I mean, if she hitched a ride on a plane, it's not like they would know. Would she, though? Some old uh, um, friends <laughs> of hers are in New Orleans right now. Yeah, you have old friends in New Orleans. You know, that band you like so much. (laughs) Yeah, right. Oh, yeah. (laughs) That is true. They are here. They are searching. They are hiding. That should be the stream title. New friends, or old friends in New Orleans. (laughs) It's a good title. Meeting old friends in New Orleans. All right. Yeah. That's cute. I like it. All right, I'm updating the title. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Title updated. All right. Everybody's silent. Okay, so what's the, what's the plan? What are we doing today? Are we gonna hide somewhere else? I've got cigarettes. Karen's to high off of it. <laughs> it's 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 like Spike when he learned he could punch demons. He's like, come on, guys, <laughs> <laughs> we gotta fight that evil. Let's fight that evil. <laughs> Go out there, do this. What do you? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> like it hit demon. <laughs> I love well, the Eva needs to spend some time in her workshop and identify if she got any majors out of that hall. Because she needs to give one up. Or the plan will have been for very little. I know someone that would disagree with you. Who? Cerebus? 
Yes. Well, she got there are a lot of charges out of that. Yes. A few significant and a lot more minor because everything she took is going to be missed. Literally, all, all Sarah had to really do is take the thing off the wall and hand it to you guys, and she still gets to keep her charm. Aww. Like, no, no, no. Yoink to you. Yoink to you. Yoink to you, you know? Everybody gets a stolen museum piece. <laughs> it, was a, it was a wonderful operation. So are we picking up back in Nolens? Is that what we're doing? Uh, Nolens. sure. All right. Cool. You can all hang on as you you return to the uh to the 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 apartment building where you all are sort of headquartered out now. Is there anything that you guys want to particularly do? I want to find out if there are any major charges in there because we need to give one to what's his face. Sure, sure, sure. So, um, uh, I'm mm -hmm. going to say that of all the things that you have collected, three of them qualify mm -hmm. for major charges. <clears throat> all right. Gotcha. One right off the wow. bat. Two that you could repair into a state that would be a major charge. Gotcha. I'd like to know if oh, I was able to like in the <laughs> was able to like smoke like a chimney on the way back. That's all I, want. I mean that is up to whether or not uh Izzy is going to throw you out of the plane in midair. I think not, but I think she's also going to text Charles and ask if he wants to get some charges cleaning the plane. <laughs> Sure, he will. He will definitely clean your plane. So here's my question. I don't know if you were just being super lenient on me last time, or if, or if the same thing will apply. Can I do ten miners and one significant for smoking a whole pack on the way back? All right. So it's about a four-hour flight, right? Two and a half. Two and a half. Two and a half. half. And it's, it says you can get a significant in an hour, right? Uh, it says, you, it says so it says um, you can get a minor by smoking one cigarette, or you can smoke a whole pack of cigarettes to get a significant, and it says, I think, about two and a half hours worth of smoking. All right. You can get one significant on the ride back if you smoke the entire pack while you're in, in the air, because it's, it's the, the, the length of the flame that you'll get one significant. Yeah, yeah. You can break that down into ten minors, or you get one significant. Well, here, here's my question: because a pack of cigarettes has twenty smokes in it, so if I were to, if I were to do like, you know, if I were to just smoke the pack and not take the significant, it'd be twenty minors. And then I think what you rolled last time is you can cash in ten minors for a significant. Is that right? I didn't rule that in. That is a rule that has been uh, informed to me about one of the avatars that ascended. Um, uh, it it allows for that chicanery um, of bundling ten miners, uh, ten uh, ten miners into a significant, which vastly changes many schools and the math needed to do things. Um, uh, the ability to break them down has always been canon, but this is apparently a thing that happens the other way. Uh, so if that was one of the players that did that, thank you. I don't know. I don't know how it happened. No. No. It was not one of the players here. It was a. It was someone I played with in when I was learning the game. Oh, okay. uh, they had they had mentioned it was about something that was mentioned in 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 the supplement thing that I had not looked into, but I have definitely said it was probably canon. Uh, anyway, so that is uh, that is that. <laughs> See so yeah, if you're taking 15 minutes and you're smoking like, well. Wait, it takes you about ten minutes to smoke a cigarette, right? Yeah, probably. So what does the, the minor charge say for time for smoking a cigarette? Call it how many minutes? 
Uh, I don't actually know off the top of my head. I'll have to open up the PDF and look. Yeah. Google said it takes six minutes to smoke a cigarette. <laughs> but that might not be, um, uh, what's it called, properly smoking a cigarette for a magical charge. All right? That's fair. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Let's see. I'm on the Ustrinaturgy stuff. Let me see. Generate minor charge. Smoke a cigarette or if you must puff on a pipe or an e-cig for a, f a few minutes. You can't pull yeah. more than one minor charge this way for every 10 minutes. Wait, 10 minutes. All right. So that's what it is. So uh, you are you are limited by a minor charge 10 minutes. Uh, in Because that requires that you have to actually enjoy. You're not just like, it's not like I speed and I smoke like two cigarettes at once and I get <laughs> yeah, two yeah. minutes. No, not you have to sit there. You have to enjoy it. You have to be the asshole, you know. You, you, you've you've seen like the 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 pictures of the smokers who are sort of sit back. They got the cigar. They're like puffing on it, and they're like ashing it there, and just like to get the twenty miners, you would need to make two significant charges. It would therefore take you three hours twenty minutes. Okay, so if one miner every ten minutes, that's two hours and two and a half hours would be six, twelve, uh, fifteen. Miners, right? Right. Yeah. And then can I cash in it, ten of those for a significant and take five miners in a significant? You may. That is a perfectly reasonable thing to do. Cool. 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 Yeah, especially since it's it's a it's a what's it called a, a a thing like if you're willing to try to bundle them together to use it, and then you can find you know if I pull this power together it works it, it all sort of merges together, uh, in yourself as you sort of be, think about it and, and meditate and do that. So you got a sig charge in you. <laughs> it's great. We got two now. You guys get back. Yeah. And you are still high on caffeine, uh, on on nicotine, which means, oh my God, you are not sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Body's in just panic mode. Yeah. No, you're fucking amped. The whole he is goddamn wired. Like. Uh. Is there anything I can do to help with that? I mean, I guess I could to like. Uh... Yes. You ask Mercedes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ask the lady who gave you the oh, super oh, blunt. Oh. Get yeah, get another super blunt. She's doing science. She needs more than one example. Okay. Yeah, I'll ask her. I'll... Oh God. <laughs> no. Oh, it was sarcasm. Okay. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna do it anyways. I, I mean, get... it was half sarcasm. She's a scientist. <laughs> you, here. you guys, you guys, you you guys have to see and talk amongst yourselves. <laughs> Nox. Tilly music. walks by with like a handmade rat stuffy and just looks at Darren like you you good? Eyes are bloodshot. There's bags under my Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> how how do you let's go get Mercedes? <laughs> She just like grabs him by the like whatever he's wearing and just like drags him down to her lap. Yeah, I'll go with. I'll uh, I'll uh, ash out my cigarette before going into her lap. I'm not trying to blow the place up or anything. I really wish you wouldn't do that inside, but I get it. Gross, man. It's not that gross. It's like it's. It's kind of gross. I don't know. It's kind of um... you know what they put in those things, dude. Well, yeah. Okay, then. Then it's gross. All right. Uh, that's not gross. Then I just like make my way down the stairs to the basement lab. Like, hail camp. <laughs> uh, nobody shoot or attack me, please. I know y'all tend to be jumpy. Okay, you got a good point. It's Tilly and Darren. Are you here for Sadie? Nope. What do you want? Uh, 
do you have anything to fix this one? And I like put Darren in front of her. He's like, he looks wrecked, I'm sure. He is whacked out right now, like on his cigarettes. I'm just, um, yeah. Have you slept, Darren? Uh, so, since when? When's the last time you slept? What do you mean since? <laughs> <laughs> Before the heist, for sure, right? The just, the just answer the is before. no. Then he has not yeah. slept. Okay, so you're looking at a uh, we're gonna call that uh, a minus fifteen penalty uh, to basically all of your actions that require fine motor function. Uh, has anybody else slept since then? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> mm hmm. Oh. Sleeping is a everyone, normal thing. Yeah, everyone else isn't getting up every every hour to like smoke a cigarette. Uh, I mean, every four hours, but yeah. Uh, everyone else isn't covered in nicotine patches. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, it's a three patch problem. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you got anything that's gonna help me sleep? Maybe. <sighs> Well, she asked for something to fix you. Oh, uh, there's yeah, no, no, no. We uh, like he needs sleep. I realized my error in my phrasing. Yeah, good luck fixing fix the me. sleep yeah. deprivation for this one. I don't, I don't think you're like a miracle worker or anything. I'll just take the sleep. That's me. Uh, surprise. <laughs> she like says it under her breath. <laughs> What about the super blunt? Did the, do you think the super blunt would just knock him out and make him sleep for a couple of days? Um, no, that entirely amped him up. Um, point of order, I am a miracle worker. <laughs> oh, really? Nope, I am. <laughs> Izzy, you're not here right now. <laughs> I'm sorry, there, I love there. you. Words have various meanings, guys. Um, uh, uh, would uh, I? I mean, she's she's a she is a flying woman and a she's a woman who can fly and uh, uh, make <laughs> magic drugs. I'd say that's miracles. Um, uh, but she is not a miracle worker, which is Izzy, as she keeps saying. <laughs> I make divine purity. What do you do, Darren? smoke cigarettes and I complain about things. Exactly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Darren, oh my um, god. Darren, you're you're not you're uh, ma'am, he is the most pussy whipped fucking adept I've ever <laughs> seen that's confronted in the which school is better war. It was just uh, I make divine <laughs> miracles all I have is cancer. <laughs> that, was, that was why oh, it was I funny. That was the point. I smoke and I complain. Yeah, it was like my, it was like if, my I drink if, and I know things, right? Like, I, it is your drink and you know things. <laughs> I I mean I mean the, the the funniest thing is if you go to like you know if if you go to Jake and you're like and she's like I'm a div I make divine purity goes I fuck with people's heads all right <laughs> I ma I manipulate the vi I dance like pup people on puppet strings that's what I do and if you go to Cat she goes I see the world how it truly is I get to the truth all right at the bottom of the bottle there is truth what the fuck do you do. You look, you look at a, you look at David in the you, background, and she's going, "No, but I test you on strings, and and I I know the truth." But <laughs> no, you don't say that because if you do that, you lose all your fucking charges. If you talk to Skinner, Skinner's going to be like, "I, I manipulate you." All right, your flesh, your body. Like, I was like, oh, you—you you may think that the soul is what's important, but like, have you ever been a soul without a fucking body? Ask a goddamn demon. It sucks. 
All right? You need a body to do fucking anything, and that's what I control. And if you go to Potatoes, he goes, you have no clue. These TV shows? <laughs> oh, my God. Modern-day fucking parables. All right? I smoke because I like it. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Yeah, you know, everyone is going to look at you and go, get the fuck out of here. Who invited you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Who invited I mean, like, you to like, our crazy party? What, all what, right. What else would I say? Like, uh, I don't, I don't know. Like, how you put it in such grandiose terms? Like, so here's, to, do you know how how you've you you have likely been all right? Uh, all right. Your teacher has likely uh talked to you about the the historical uses of tobacco. For uh, various medicine rituals, yeah, yeah, and other uh, things like that. So, um, are you saying you're going to spit on all of those tribes' things by saying that there's not something magical about tobacco? Oh, I'm not saying that Yours? at all. Yeah. Well, then, 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 fucking act like it. <laughs> act, <laughs> act like it. All right. Then, then you, you need to be bitch? as obsessed as 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 mind bent around this tobacco <laughs> stuff. As any one of these people here. Steph, mm, mwah, kudos on everything you fucking do. All right? <laughs> All right? And uh, so, Tilly, Tilly, now I have to ask you, what do you do? I put on a different mask to change the world. Yeah. No. You adopt, you become people. I am you. No, literally, hey. I'm you. Yeah. Anyway. The most chill adept. Like, she's like, <laughs> oh, no, my magic, it's nothing that big. And all the other adepts go, the fuck? <laughs> we found the spy! <laughs> you took my job. I mean, it literally Rude says. It literally says in the PDF, they smoke because they like it. <laughs> oh my God. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> like, I'm, not, I'm not bullshit. But the plain fact is, people smoke because they like it. They smoke because it looks good, feels good, and tastes good. Uh, see now, we're getting into decade pop culture at that point, my guy. Okay, so, so, so here, I need you to say that again. But I need you to put the proper <laughs> emphasis on those words, like they are the most important thing you've ever said. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you need to you need to take that stick and ram it so far up your own ass that it makes your back straight when you go. No, people smoke because they like it. All right. <laughs> all it right. Make it a point, it Darren. Feels good. All right. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. I want you to have the same commitment about tobacco that Steph fucking has about her goddamn drugs. <laughs> but she goes, no. <laughs> you should never smoke anything that isn't laced with tobacco. 100%. Laced with you what are... now? Tobacco. tobacco. He sh yeah, he needs to... Okay. You should never smoke anything that is not mixed in with tobacco, because tobacco is the er drug, all right? All the other shit that Mercedes is peddling, utter fucking garbage trash, all right? Trash. <laughs> oh, okay. I thought I was here to get something to help Marijuana? Marijuana is devil's fucking lettuce, all right? <laughs> it makes you weak, all right? Tobacco is your god. Tobacco is your god. <laughs> don't smoke, kids. All right. Seriously, please, the love of God, don't kids. smoke. This is why please, we please. got a God, shocking so content. To you. Please, God. Mm -hmm. Shocking content. Don't do drugs, yeah, kids. Yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> shocking content. DM emphasizes the need for a character to smoke. <laughs> If I tried to tell you, all the adepts are crazy pants. Yeah. And you want to know the ones that you should really look out for? They're the adepts who seem normal on the surface. Because they just know how to hide their crazy pants. If I met... What is it? I'm a homicidal maniac. They look like just... Every 
They look just like everybody else. Yes. I'm a smoking adept. <laughs> we look like everybody else. Well, 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 we have Father Thomas. Hi. I'm the sweetest, nicest person you're ever going to fucking meet. Oh, yeah, that we saw him dumping animal carcasses or whatever. Who could Don't literally or kill never... you with the... No! No! You want a rat, bucko? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> all the rats. You do not want all the rats. We'll let Raylan so you in take the all the rats. He needs to go to something else. <laughs> goldfish. Goldfish. <laughs> uh, it's really hard to drown a goldfish. <laughs> yeah, you just do the opposite. <laughs> you just don't feed it. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, that is that is not a a sufficient ritual. Not feeding something is not a sufficient ritual for him. Uh, well, you know, I'm not anyway. a death god or whatever. <laughs> <so>. <laughs> not for lack of wanting it. All right. So it's April seventeenth, eighteenth, I believe, is the morning. Okay. April eighteenth. A 19% remainder on your guys' task. So we left on the 16th, did the heist on the 17th, and now it's the 18th? Yeah. Okay. Well, you arrived there on... You left and arrived there on the 16th to do a little bit of reconnaissance. You basically spent a, a night planning it out, and then you hit it the next day, and now you're traveling back. That's That's kind of the thing there. All right, tish your ass is down. And she's going to start digging around, pull out a bunch of pill bottles, get a little mortar and pestle. Drug Baroness. Uh, it has to be minus... Uh, we're going to give you minus 10 on this. Don't forget to add some tobacco to it. The love of Christ, not that garbage. And you ask me for help, you get what I give you. I roll my eyes. Congratulations, Darren. Don't be rude. <laughs> Never gonna sleep again. No, nope. right. I mean, so good. I'm grinding up Xanax, Kalanapin, Valium, and I'm throwing in some fentanyl for added measure. You're giving him the silent night. <laughs> Jesus. The silent God. night. And fentanyl. Oh my God. Uh, I mean, I don't know she failed. Right. He doesn't oh know she failed. Yeah, no. That's perfectly fine. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be okay. <laughs> Are you taking it? I mean... Uh, I can't... Here, go ahead and snort this. I It'll get into your bloodstream faster. Yeah, I can't metagame it. I have to take it. Yeah, I mean, I was going to take it. I trust, sure. I trust need Mercedes. you to make me a fitness check. Minus 15. Uh, okay. <laughs> mm, that's going to go great. Uh, oh boy. <laughs> okay. Uh, you know what? I'm probably gonna fail it anyways. I'll just I'll just use my identity. Uh. So optimistic. Well, it's a twenty-five versus a uh, a forty. One and four. Oh, I forget it. I'll just do the. I'll just do the reroll. What did I miss? I had to step away. I'm sorry. There you go. There's the. Yep. Yep. All yep. right. So here's the question: Do you want to keep that, or do you want to flip that? I'll flip it. 
flip it. All right. Yeah, yeah, I'll flip it. So what are you using to flip it? I will use my noble stimulus. All right. So yeah, you take that hit of bad drugs. Like, oh, uh, so, uh, yeah, no, um, uh, as you do this, you get about halfway through before you realize that this shit is potent, that, uh, um, it is highly likely that, um, uh, someone who is way more drug tolerant, like, um, uh, Mercedes, who does this shit a lot, calculated for herself instead of you. Which means, had you done all of it, this would have been an overdose. Awesome. You have avoided overdosing. <laughs> That's a good thing. But your nasal capa your na your nostrils are bleeding <laughs> because <laughs> like so many blood vessels have fucking popped and you are uh you are definitely struggling for breath on the ground. <laughs> uh Mercedes, is that normal? You know an OD. When you see one. She's gonna be like, yeah, that's normal. <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> <laughs> Do I need to roll if it's one of my of course I guess? Oh well, what is the of course I can? I'm an unofficial pharmacologist, of course I can stop an overdose. Sure, yeah. No, you have to roll for that still. Okay. <clears throat> It, it, of course, I can let you let you roll for it. <laughs> Please don't let me die. Oh my god! Are you flipping it, or are you going to keep it like that? <laughs> um, I'm going to flip it with my noble passion of Which loyalty. Alright, uh, please write that, write that you flipped it with there. Uh, so. You give him some shit. You give him some more drugs to counteract the drugs that he's on. Which is just like, ah, oh. so Darren... You are now on the floor, going in and out of consciousness, in pain, in constant <laughs> pain, because you did drugs that were not tobacco. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't watch her make This it. is your fault, Darren. <laughs> is it my fault? I don't know. It's your like, fault. It's like it's Mercedes' fault. She failed the role. Did, did, did Mercedes tie you down and make you do those drugs? No, all right. No, no, fair enough. All right. All right. Your fault. This is why you don't do drugs, kids. All right. No <laughs> smoking, no drinking, no doing drugs, because apparently this is a kid show. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Instead of, I don't know, the actual show that it is about, like, uh, a bunch of whacked off people just, you know, <laughs> doing crazy things. We just put those, you know, like, viewer discretion advice things at the front for fun. Like, <laughs> we hand out things like candy in here. Yes. Anyway. Uh, so. Uh, One in ten candies is least. I mean, when you say candy, they're all just pills. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got the Viagra. Yum. Anyway. So, what's everyone else doing as Darren is having the worst night of his life? Uh, 
I'm gonna call this. Uh, this is probably helplessness three, but I think that you're. Uh, yeah. Definitely. You're actually we're probably helplessness five. I'm definitely hardened to help helplessness All five. Right. Yeah, good. You're like, ah, this is not fun, but oh shit, you know. This is the worst. I know one thing that can help. <laughs> Light cigarette. No, you, you no have... God, no, why? God you, damn it. You literally do not have the cord. All right, so you're, you're going to try to light the cigarette, all right? All right? I yeah. need you to roll me fitness minus 30, all right? Oh, wow. All right. All right. I can do this. It's not a big deal. My 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 skill is twenty five. By the way, here you go. Hey, I'll take the failure. All right. Yeah, take it. So you 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 see him pull out the the cigarette Whoop. and like 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 his hand. He puts it to his lips, and and then he goes for his lighter. And as he does, his lips go numb, and the cigarette just falls out. <laughs> And so he's there, like, flipping the lighter open as it slips from his hands and goes to the floor. He's just like, uh... You know, like, pawing around for the lighter on the floor. Like, you know... He does not have the hand-eye coordination to do this. Somebody light this for me, please. Uh, This is how you got here, dingus. Uh, Bless you don't know how what I gave you is going to mix with the tobacco and the nicotine. I'm just saying. Darren, they are barking like dogs, all right? You cannot understand a single thing they say. In fact, you cannot speak <laughs> properly, all right? You're like, I know a lie is do not, You do not have good diction? You, <laughs> okay, okay, all right. Until he runs upstairs and starts screaming for Izzy. <laughs> it's not good, it's not good, it's not good. He just needs to sleep it off, he'll be fine. <laughs> It was, it was, it was that last time I checked any medical textbook, that was along the lines of a stroke, and anything along the lines of a stroke is a bad time. I'm gonna go get Izzy. <laughs> okay. Izzy, what are you doing as this is unfolding? <laughs> Tilly's like pounding on your door, like what? Izzy. God damn it! <laughs> In a very infuriating roundabout way. <laughs> About what everyone else did. <laughs> okay, you are you are informing uh, informing <laughs> your uh, your your leader about what everyone else did. Uh-huh. All right, it's fair. Uh, so you hear you hear down the hall someone pounding on a door and sh- shouting your name. Hold, please. <laughs> what kind of like what what now? <laughs> Uh, so, uh, Darren didn't feel good because he had so many cigarettes and we brought him down to Mercedes so that he could get better because Mercedes is the mastermind with the drugs and, uh, it's not going well. Please come fix the Darren. And she, like, gives her a cute little innocent smile and grabs her hand and starts running. Okay. <laughs> Getting tugged along. So, uh, question. Who here has seen um uh uh what's it called um Is it Pulp Fiction, Brandon? It's not Pulp Fiction. Okay. David Hasselhoff eating a cheeseburger on the floor. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, great. That's that's Darren right now. All right. I mean, it's me pretty that much is... every episode. Let's Darren, <laughs> Darren, Darren wishes he was as cognizant as David Hasselhoff in that thing. 
Darren <laughs> is there's there's a there's a police video of a guy who who woke up in the front seat of his car on the road. That is the level of cognition that he has. Where he's like, "What are you doing? <laughs> Yo, you're causing a disturbance." <laughs> I'm fine. I'm just sleeping. I'm driving and I'm sleeping. I'm <laughs> traveling. Traveling. Alright. I have the word. Sovereign <laughs> citizen. I'm fine, Flashifer. I'm fine. Miss. Mercedes has just kind of gone back to her notebook and is jotting shit down. Yep. Alright. Um, I guess I'll try to heal him. I don't know if he's taking damage from this. <laughs> sure, sure. You, 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 it does not, this is not damage. In fact, this is almost like, oh, just desserts of his own action. He's not <laughs> injured. You can He's fine. Yeah, you, you, all right, so it, roll me, roll me your medicine identity to sort of give him a once over. Uh, if you want to get, if you want to figure out, try to figure out what's going on, you need to, like, you know, give him a med checkup. Uh. I'm scared. I don't think I'm allowed to use medicine on people. You're not allowed to use medicine to treat people. You can assess things, alright? Okay. Sure. Um, no, he's high. He is... Super fucking high, alright? Uh <laughs> like Darren is several is sh several sheets to the wind high off his ass. Because Mercedes likely handed him a shit ton of in fact you can see the powder on the floor. As you look at it, it goes, those are several types of drugs mixed together. It or takes you back to party days with Mercedes. <laughs> Where she would make you the best shit, and then you guys would pass out together with your nose bleeding exactly like his is bleeding. You know? <laughs> Welcome to Sharp Ion Robots. Oh, sorry about that. One second. Alexa, shut up. Shark Island Robots? <laughs> my shark robot is on the fritz. It's not <laughs> patrolling my. <laughs> I put a laser beam on its forehead. <laughs> laser guided shark robots. <laughs> laser right? beams on their freaking forehead. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's vacuum cleaner, guys. Come on now. Put anyway. a laser pointer on his freaking forehead. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. Izzy uh goes one second, and she runs upstairs, and she comes back with something clenched in a pair of like kitchen tongs. And she hands it over to, um, she, like, ha holds it out to, uh, Tilly. Like, she's gonna drop it into her hands. Like, the thing that's in the top. And Tilly puts her hands out, a little worried about putting this on her bare skin <laughs> with the tongs situation, but okay. Um, Izzy, uh, opens the tongs, and, uh, Narcan, um, Pen falls into your hands, and she says, use that on him. If it gets worse. <laughs> Other than that, he'll be okay. Just try to keep a nicotine patch on him, or he'll taboo. Then he'll feel even worse than he does now. <laughs> Just give him, like, 30 minutes and he'll be out cold. Means thank you. And, and <laughs> speak. I vomit. <laughs> the one thing that is certain, he, he definitely does have an officer problem. All right. Can we can we pre-K pause? Because Hubby <laughs> wants you guys to hear this TikTok he just found. <laughs> you know how a cat likes. Oh, it cut off. Okay, unpause. <laughs> I'm sorry. He was very insistent on this. Okay. 
We heard about half of it, but it's fine. Oh, it's this guy telling a joke. It says, uh, you know, do you know how a cat likes a steak? There's a pause, and he goes, rare. Okay. Okay, we're done. Okay. <laughs> Darren's not dead. He just threw up. Great times. I turn him on his side. I reach for my cigarettes again. God damn it, no. <laughs> Where are your patches? Uh, you know what? I'm not even going to wait for you to incoherently answer me. I'm going to search your fucking pockets for your nicotine patches and slap one on your fucking neck. I swear to God. Another one on his uh, neck? Because he's already wearing like three. I don't know. Just slap it on something. No, put it on his forehead. Put it on him in a couple of hours if he hasn't come around yet. For now, I'll just leave him be. Okay. All right. I'll just be pastel on the floor. You'll have fun. Haley, what I'm are gonna, you doing? I'm going to take some of his nicotine patches and put them in my scarf pocket. Just so I have sure. them. Haley? I just need out of here a charge because she just burnt four of them you're trying to sneak out of here to get a charge oh, yes no. I didn't do the research for nothing sure 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 I need you to roll me secrecy minus 20 okay don't get shot again <laughs> it's it's fine <laughs> Oh, hold on. She's not in the same room as us, is she? No. <laughs> I was literally like, I want to roll notice. Let's see if I notice. It's like minus 80. Damn it. Why, why are you taking forever? Okay. It. All right. You are out. You are free. Izzy, your yeah. phone rings. Who is it? Cat. I pick up the phone. Hello. Is Haley down there with you? Or wherever no. you are? No, I left her in the apartment. Alright, because I step out of, the sh out of the shower and she's not there. One second. I'm going to pull up um, find my friends again. you have your phone with you, Haley? Yes. He's not an idiot. Do you have Find My Friends on? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Izzy will say she left. Presumably, unless she left her phone in a taxi or something, she's on the move. Do you, um... Mommy and Joker to come with you? You two handle it. I'm I'll handle her when she gets back. Okay. Please don't kill anyone or burn anything down. Thank you. <laughs> Just hang up and go get Jake. You can almost hear a I make no promises <laughs> echoing throughout the building. I know. <laughs> Comes moaning back through the wind. <laughs> uh, 
Um. So the place that I'm headed towards is, um, if I can freaking say it right, um, Pisa d'Italia, I think is what it's called. Um, and that's a place for the tribute to Italian immigrants in New Orleans. Uh, it was dedicated to the city in 1978. Sure. Uh, there is at least a minor charge there that you can uh, pull up. Um, we're going to try to hit one more before we go back. Um, can I roll, I don't know, for something to catch up? Oh, no, you're definitely going to catch up on the way there. Okay. she would go to would be um, the old Ursuline Convent Museum. Alright. Probably another minor charge. Although you are stopped on the way there by a familiar looking car that sort of pulls up in front of you with two familiar Probably one, probably just one, one dude who's just like, I am just going to stare ahead and not acknowledge any emotions. I, I take it that that's us, yes. Okay, uh, how are you getting around the city, by the way, Haley? Depending on how far it is she walks, uh, if it's too far, mm, she probably took her own vehicle, because that is a thing. I oh, need you to commit to an answer, dearie. Well... I don't I don't know cuz I don't know exactly where these are in the city itself so we'll just say car. Okay. Um Izzy hops out, out of the car and she comes and she taps on your window like she's a cop. <laughs> and she's standing there with her arms kind of crossed. Slowly rolls down the window. Haley. Yes. What are we doing? Getting more charges. What do you think I'm doing? What did we do wrong? You guys were busy. And... I had my phone on me, so that's at least decent enough. So the phone prevents you from getting shot? No, the gun and the knife prevents, well, helps prevent me. Maybe I, you know, I don't always think, think things through, damn it. Yeah, Jake was playing video games, Kat was in the shower, and I was downstairs. You could have talked to any of us. Okay, but you do realize that Cat would have never actually let me leave, right? Well, I mean, that's between you and her. Come on, out of the car. We're leaving it here. We'll send some of the thirds to pick it up later. Let, let me finish getting one, my one, my last one. I mean, 
fine, but you need to actually bring people with you. Several people. Kind of grumbles. What's the point of being in the super squad if you leave everyone at home all the time? <laughs> I'm sorry that I like to do things unnoticed. Uh, a complicated series of emotions goes across Izzy's face and then disappears. <laughs> well, too damn bad. War is on. You don't get to go around alone. Nobody does. Come on, let's go. She gets up out of the car and pouts the whole damn time as she gets into the other car. <laughs> Joker is going to stand on up, get in the other car, and say, I'll meet you guys back. Are you sure that's a good idea? I wouldn't know as he hops out of the car and <laughs> walks around and gets into the other car. Yeah, he's trying not to be pissed at you. So that sucks for a number of reasons. Okay, let's hit this last place of yours and then we're going home. If you promise... That you will not do this again without at least two people with you. Which is waggling her finger and staring you down. She's going to hold her pinky out and just like, I pinky promise. Okay. So with all that settled, and you returning, and uh, Joker being nowhere in sight when you do, uh, what is it that every what is what is the next step for you all? I'm still ODing. Yes. Okay. We're going to assume that you guys can wait out. Oh, do you do you want to continue on while he's ODing, or do you want to wait until he recovers? Mercedes uh, is going to babysit him and she's going to start working on a dose of solar gold. Sure. I mean, I vote weight recovery. Because <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. Having huh? everybody back is better than being missing people and they might die. How useful am I going to be? <laughs> I will take you out myself. I swear to God. <laughs> so. April 19th. Do I sleep? You have <clears throat> fitful sleeps, but you do manage to rest, which means that your thing has been cleared. Hooray! You Does are Jake no longer. Come back? What? Does Jake come back? Uh, Jake, Jack, yeah, Jake comes back before he even wakes up. Uh, he fe he seems a little more uh like his normal self. Uh. Does he have any minor injuries, as one might theoretically get in a bar fight? Uh, possibly, yeah. He's, he's got, you know. <laughs> and he may even have a couple bullet grazes. What did you do? <laughs> Nothing. 
just may have uh, told a couple of uh, punks that uh, uh, the um, uh, the voice can suck my left nut. I see. You're keeping the right one for someone special. Thanks Speaking for that. <laughs> he winks and gives the finger guns. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. But yeah, no, they're carrying guns now, so uh, that's good to know. Bill can't hit the broadside of a barn. I mean, unless unless barn is the name of the dude who he shot, uh, then totally can hit that guy. Is my ward on Joker gone? Uh... You aren't able to tell. Okay. I'm gonna take a moment sometime over the next little while and fix that. <laughs> sure. Alright, but Darren is waking up to ash and dust. <laughs> Uh, how am I feeling? Uh, more rested, but also fucking in pain. Like, you know, like your heart tried to leap out of your goddamn chest. All right. All right. So good enough for a cigarette then. <laughs> yeah. I swear. Oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, you want me to treat it like I'm obsessed over it, right? So it's been a little while. It's been like a day. It's been, it's been a minute. It's <laughs> Nope, you're playing your character perfectly. <laughs> I'll try to meditate. I'll try. I'm just going to like burn some tobacco in the room or something. Sure. Get that smoke, you know, instead of cigarettes, you know. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to get that smoke. That's exactly. I think I got that smoke already. To be honest. Yep. <laughs> so you're all gathered. Uh, you are uh, free to do what you want. Uh, more than that, uh, uh, you've definitely got information on the uh, the charges. What's <clears throat> what's the uh, what's the plan for today, folks? What are we doing? Well, yeah. oh, Mercedes, please go ahead. Have we figured out what we're bribing? internet creeper with uh, was Aoife invited to this conversation because she'd be in her um, workshop otherwise I mean I don't see why not kind of assumed we were all getting together by the sound of things gotcha um then she'll say, uh, yes, I have an item, um, that should attract his attention immediately. Um, I really don't 
want to give it up, but I that's the whole reason we did this, so I'm trying to be good. Okay. Are we gonna have to like take it away from you or anything like that? Well, gee, Darren, I don't know. Let's if, not uh, get someone, hostile. If someone gave you like, you know, magical, mystical tobacco from some, you know, <laughs> crazy Native American tribe or whatever the fuck it was that was going to give you a major charge without cancer. Would you have a hard time giving it up? <laughs> you mean peyote? I'm not sure that's special enough, but. Uh, yeah, maybe Sorry. I should, maybe one of us sh should hang on to it. Then. That might be a good idea. I'm trying to be disciplined. Sorry for the uh, snippishness. Anyway. It should attract his attention. Now someone just needs to write to him. I can do it if you want me to. Cat uh, is going to say that it's likely the best that we try to entrust that with Skinner. He might have access to um, uh, other channels that are not as public. Um, because... Uh, if you put out the hey, we we were handed out a major charge on like you know the circles, you can expect a shit ton of people to be interested. Oh no, um, Ifa lifted the um, email addresses that Skinner gave to Izzy. Um, oh okay. Was fine. I'm gonna say if Skinner's the one sending the email, someone else needs to proofread it. So he doesn't try and force them into signing on to. Yeah. I'll proofread it. Um, that's fine and all, <clears throat> but this is easy talking. Sorry, I need to remember to specify. That's probably fine and everything. <laughs> but they're in like sibling groups, so it's not as though. He's really going to try to recruit him or something. They're already on the same team. Kind of. Alright. Well, whatever. Okay, well, just because they're in the same organization doesn't mean that he's under Skinner. Yeah, but Skinner's not really like that. He could have a bigger kingdom than he than he does, but he's good with what he's got. I'm sorry. Part. The man tried to get an inanimate object to Are swear fealty still... to him. So that he yeah, could we're heal still it. Doing this. <laughs> Please. There, continue with your thought. It it so he could heal it. It's not great to have a limb you can't fix. Can't take it to a doctor. Then mechanomancers are the are the mechanomancers are the most rare kind of adept that there is. So that's what to do? Go crazy. Um, it's pieces of metal. It doesn't have health. Ifa says, "I beg to differ." <laughs> They most certainly do have vitality. Yeah, like it probably rusts at least, <clears throat> right? Yeah, no, I'm over here like, well, there's rust and there's probably several other things. Probably got to put like, <clears throat> like WD-40 on it every once in a while or something. WD-40? <laughs> no, 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 no. It's alive. It's a limb. You just can't heal it with medicine. We're getting into crazy adaptive territory here, people. It's never going to end. <laughs> uh huh. Okay, then. 
Well, if we wrote out a message and we proofread it ahead of time, we just gave it to Skinner like, hey, can you can you maybe deliver this message? Do you think he'd be willing to do that? Probably. Okay, then I think that bypasses all the problems that we've been talking about. I think it's fun. Alright, well, let's set it up then. Um, so I guess out of character question, what is our new objective? Isn't it offer goods to Crypto Grandpa? No, I think it's make the book. Um, one of the milestones of which is to get information from Crypto Grandpa. Okay, so on the campaign goal sheet, um, we have gain access to Crypto Grandpa's knowledge. Um, I mean, so if we did something like that as a milestone, you know, making contact with him would be a step in that. So I suppose we could make it its own objective, gaining access to Crypto Grandpa's knowledge. And like, the problem is, can we come up with enough milestones for that? Well, how many milestones do you need for a single segment? To build up enough percentage that you can roll it and have a hope of winning? Ah, oh, son of a bitch. That's a lot. Yeah, but we're also starting out at 19% anyways. Yeah, so we could add things like um, making initial contact with him, um, setting up, giving him the major clock, um, you know, actually obtaining knowledge from him, you know, Learning more about who he is, possibly. I'm, I'm going to say this is a little overkill for what you guys are going to get. Like, you are likely not going to be able to drag this out into an objective. Uh, okay. Yeah, I didn't think so. That's valid. Yeah. So, are you guys putting out word for it? Well, we're making a note or a letter for Skinner to send to his last known email addresses. Sure. Uh, Skinner will totally do that. All right. uh, Skinner will totally do that. So yeah, you guys have the letter and it's, it's, it's written. He agrees. He makes some like little adjustments to basically explaining that he's, you know, the head of a a, a max uh, uh, max affiliated group in uh, Tennessee in uh, in 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 New Orleans, uh, you know. Uh, he is he is not there. Uh, uh, the first response you get is "Nice try, Erica." Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> I swear. Okay, dude, give me the thing. Let me take a picture with it, flicking him off, and then you can send that. No, 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 no. 
Uh, all right, so you are you are definitely not let anywhere near the message. Uh, he's already saying that he's already sent his response to this person. All right. Oh God. Uh, he's just he just re 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 told Cat and um uh, and Joker, and thus they disseminated to you that this person's response was nice try, Erica. <laughs> It's not a code, is it? <laughs> ah! Do you wanna, you know, if you want information, learn to fucking ask questions! <laughs> if I do chicken, then you also want chicken? Chicken. Like those questions, yes! <laughs> <laughs> well, what, what's a. Is secrecy a thing to roll to see if it's a code? What? No! You do not. Well, shit. No role is going to do this. Well, damn. What are, are you asking someone something? Uh, Skinner's the one who got the message, right? Yes. I asked Skinner. Skinner's also, out, uh, Skinner's kind of also away from you. Skinner is not currently oh. with you. You got this information from Jack and Cat. Jake. Jake. We have Jake too many J names in our games. Yeah. <laughs> Well, then I'll ask each of those. Oh, oh. Asking Jake oh. might be a far, far fetch. I just had a very inappropriate joke drop in my head that I'm going to now have to send to Brandon perhaps today. Wait, this. All right. <laughs> I don't know if either of them are really the best to ask the question. I know. As soon as it came out of my mouth, I was just like, I'm asking Joker if yeah. this is something. Yeah. And the other one drinks like a fish. Joker knows things sometimes. I asked both of them, is this some kind of code that you guys are aware of? I had to look at you. All right, cool. I I guess that means no. Can I get an affirmative on the no? If that is correct. <laughs> they walk away. I swear to God. <laughs> Literally say nothing. <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> I go to Skinner's room and I knock on his door. <laughs> He's busy. He is busy. I hate it. <laughs> you don't even have to open the door. Is it a code? <laughs> is what a code? <laughs> it's a nice try, Erica. Code, please. <laughs> no response from from them. I... You know. It's almost like you're asking the wrong people, all right? Tilly. <laughs> what? I got an idea. Oh, no. Is it involved drugs? That's a stupid question around you. I say that very affectionately. <laughs> you remember the mirrors? Yeah. Okay, so we get a copy of the email, and then we do LSD, and we Jesus. see if it talks to us. Uh... <laughs> oh, 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 yeah. Can is he over here and part of this conversation? Yes. All? Yes. Oh, yeah. And then my husband walks in on me just laying in the floor, looking at a piece of paper um, and screaming. Like, what? Um, <laughs> guys? Yes. Nice is he in the back? That's not a code. Tilly just looks kind of done. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I'll be fair. It's been code of a, after code. It's somewhat of a coded message. It's just it's not. As, it's as much of a code as an inside joke is code. <laughs> Only it's not a joke. <laughs> How do you know that? We haven't looked at it yet. Because I'm in Pops. And I've heard them talk about things. Is it a code? 
Well, er- Erica's a person, but they don't like so much. And I hang out with drug dealers. Do you think that means that I know all of their hookups? Okay, so the thing about the Max is that they're kind of gone, and the ones that are still around are mostly in other franchises. So the original Max that actually exist, pretty good. The Pops good um burger king bad and um um well, what you call it um starbucks is real bad so er- erica's with with burger king and she looks really unhappy to be saying any of those names <laughs> well that's part of the status truth i've learned today yes Thanks. everyone in the underground knows that max is dead I knew there was something off about Starbucks. I meant that Starbucks was bad, but yes, the other stuff is also bad. Wait. <clears throat> wait, wait, wait. Max no, is... no, I mean, never, was... never, never go to get... Never, never get anything to drink from the mermaid. <laughs> Ever. Again. Okay. No, seriously? Don't do it. No, I'm listening to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I hear you. I have other caffeine highways. I can go without the Starbucks. Embrace the mermaid. <laughs> no. 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 The pop God. discreetly give out small charges to people that they think might be good people to have magic. And the mermaid gives out beverages that control your mind and Ooh. make you... Do stuff for them. So don't, don't, don't go there. Yeah. Get your coffee somewhere else. Hmm. Sounds like capitalism. I mean, yes, yes but also that is magic. 100% what it is. <laughs> Magical capitalism. Yes. <laughs> okay. But okay. Well, who is there any like who's Erica then? We got to find Erica? No. I mean, I don't know everything cuz half of it came through Joker and his explanations of things are kind of scrambled, but from what I gather, he was like some sort of big wig in the hey, mask hey, and hey. they didn't then she left. <laughs> hey, um uh question can you think of someone in max uh in pops that might be more amenable to talking about things than say joker or cat night shift or clean potatoes oh yeah that too (laughs) but you have to deal with them hitting on people (laughs) And and he really doesn't like um, the BK crowd. But he might be more willing to explain what the BK crowd is. Uh... Fair, fair, fair. People talk about shit they hate a lot, so... Called ranting for a reason. All right, I will boy. call Potatoes and ask him to come over to this apartment. Hey, he's a great... Hi, how... what's going on? Where are you guys? What do you mean? I'm at home! Like, I've been waiting for anyone to reach out and contact me! <laughs> Oh yeah! You gotta just like disappear. <laughs> oh no! Oh, shit. Um. Well, Good God. <laughs> we kind of moved in with the thirty thirds. We've got like a. What, what the fuck? <laughs> we we kind of have like um um an alliance of convenience going on because the voice is bad. 
Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. I just need you to say not everything's good if you're all being held at gunpoint. All right? Okay? I feel like Tilly wants to, like, talk on the phone and Potatoes be like, give me the phone, give me the phone. Everything is terrible <laughs> and we're not being held at gunpoint. No! <laughs> <laughs> Are you, are you only saying that because I'm on speaker and they can hear us or they're listening in? You're not on speaker and I am fine and everyone is fine and even Skinner is here. They're being very nice and helping us to be safe and you should probably come move in too. Yeah. So what about my mom? Uh, um, is she wise? I mean, like, she's my mom. Like, she taught me oh everything you fucking know. God. Everything. Pete, Pete. does she know about magic? <laughs> she makes really good food. Does she pick up all the way <laughs> down potatoes? Yes, but does she know that it's magic? Fine magic. <laughs> oh my god. With a K, oh. Pete. No, well, well, all right. Look, I mean, I mean, hey, hey, she understands the good meal. All right, all right. Look, 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 look. All right. <laughs> Who's this? Hey, hi. Oh, jeez. I Peter. miss you. <laughs> oh my. Are you gonna come hang out with us? <sighs> I mean, sure. Uh. <laughs> Who is this again? Mercedes. He's a sexy Mercedes. redhead. Yeah. <laughs> it's a commercial. That's right. I don't remember meeting a sexy redhead. I, I, this doesn't seem like something I would forget. Huh. I'm going to slap him through the phone. I swear to God. She was there. <laughs> the dinner party. Gordon Ramsay. I must have blacked out. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, if you don't want to come hang out with us. Oh, no, where are you guys at? Like, you know, are you sure everything's cool? Like, you know, not a trap, you know? Like, I, let me finish my shows, and then I'll, I'll be over. Can't you put them on your phone? Take an Uber? Yeah, but like I got like the the whole thing set up. Like, um, why did you guys come over here? Like, you know, it's, Peter, it's roomy. There's Pete. There's a war on, and we're being watched. A war? What the fuck? Jesus Christ! <laughs> you know Welcome the store to... got hit, right? You know, <laughs> no matter how many times you guys say war. Yeah, it never sounds better, yeah. but no. Well, okay, welcome. Pete, Pete, listen to me, okay? Mm -hmm. It's Buffy, and the Scooby Squad is meeting up in the library. We're going to text you the address. All Please right. come as quickly as you can. <laughs> all right, okay, okay, all right. We'll do. <laughs> we'll do. Can I be Buffy? <laughs> all right. Wait, yeah, wait. Yeah. Over, babe. <laughs> <sighs> but no, you're supposed to be Willow. You're the redhead. Who gets I'm addicted Sandra, to then? Unless you'd prefer to be Angel or Spike. <sighs> For Ooh, these are all hard choices. I do not want to lose an <laughs> eye, though. Oh. Better your eye than your life, my guy. You're right. I shouldn't be Buffy. I should be Faith. Oh, shit. <laughs> they both die, though. Everybody dies in that show. At least once. <laughs> Some people three times. I suppose. I'm going to 
Say goodbye, hang up, and text him the address. Probably the best way to move this forward. Yeah. <laughs> what, flirting with him? No, just <laughs> hanging up and sending him the address. Oh. <laughs> Be like, He's okay, whatever, see you in a little bit. Speaking of potatoes, general silliness. <laughs> oh, Jesus. In New Orleans, potato eat you. <laughs> <laughs> So, as you all, uh, head on into, uh, there. So, uh, a few moments later, you are a, a, a chubby, uh, Asian-American gentleman is showing up there with a, 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 a TV and, like, a bunch of other stuff, like, in a cart, you know, because, bye, mom! <laughs> As he oh, runs into the my. area with the gangsters, and there is a little old Asian woman behind a car, you know. <laughs> she can barely see over the steering wheel. <laughs> oh, we love them so much. Oh. Potatoes might be my favorite character. <laughs> yeah, right. Man, this place is like, you know... Like, I don't know. Like, <laughs> like the Wire season two, maybe. It's <laughs> a really good description. But, uh, uh, All those guns, man! That's a lot of guns. <laughs> I mean, that's what happens when you bunk with a gang, man. You, you're you're the the Tilly, right? Yes. Thank you for remembering my name. <laughs> yes, sure. How have you been, friend? <laughs> I'm I'm good. I'm good. It's sort of pulls up a he should have, like opens up a, a a a a his backpack you see he is carrying boxes and boxes of tapes like you know so many tapes vhs tapes he has a vhs player in there you know <laughs> anime what was this my oh, friend yeah, no <laughs> we got like you know Oh, I got, I got animes, too. It's like, oh, another section, it's just DVDs, you know? Oh, yes, yeah. the purest. Uh, F FYI, w welcome welcome to the life of a videomancer who can fall down a rabbit hole for several days and not know about what events are going on. Because he's <laughs> charging. <laughs> that's, that's valid. Okay. Got anything good? Yeah, yeah they, <laughs> they stopped calling him to uh, to come into work. So <laughs> he's just like, I don't know, maybe they got someone else to run the fry cooker. It's fine. <laughs> maybe I just lost my job. It's fine. Yeah. Just sit here and chill. You know, he knows he didn't lose his job, all right? He <laughs> is one of the most, he is one of the most prolific, like, uh, uh, distributor of charges that they fucking have. Like, you know, he's just like, I'm charging. Like, I'm good. <laughs> Call me if you need me. Yeah. Like, the only person who comes close to being able to dish out as many charges as he can is Kat. Uh, and that's when she gets drunk on the job. Oh, he geez. just has to watch videos. <laughs> You know, no. Uh, 
Peter Lotag is very secure in his job in Pops that pays him in food. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Anyway, so some things have gone down in the last week that I think you may have missed. Um, you remember when the voice had like a mob attack the store? That was that was nuts, man. But Joker was all like ninja and like I mean, I was there. All right, I had his back. Okay. <laughs> yes. I, I, he told me. Mm -hmm. I couldn't have done it without you. However, it <laughs> happened again. And Joker was yeah. not there. Joker! Oh, well, I'm, 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 oh, I mean. Wait. What were you? I knew there were you. So Skinner was the only one there, as far as we can tell. It's just his face just goes white. He's okay now. He got it pretty bad, but we got him to the hospital. He's made a complete recovery. Awesome. No, no, he you can't. Than ever. No, he's fine. He did not agree. It's fine. He was past being able to fight. Peter just kind of sits down. Like his head in his hands, like the look of uh I promise he is here. He is one hundred percent fine and himself. However, it's pretty real out there. The voice is attacking every magic user in the city. And so Pops and the 33rds are working together to try to take him down. But because of a really complicated series of things that I don't necessarily feel like explaining right this second. Wait, wait, is, is, is that the reason? Is that the reason, like, people were taking, like, shots at my house? Oh, wow, we should have called you too. I'm sorry, what? Wow. Yeah, no, like, people were, like, firing guns at my in my house. I mean, if he was charging, that's why they went after Jeremy. Yeah, so they've got an Elemancer who can tell when people are charging. Got a who? Um, a Nullamancer? Wait, 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 what? They have an adept whose whole adept school revolves around not believing magic exists. Yet. Those fuckers? Oh, no, that's not good. What do you mean by those fuckers? They, they can shut you down. They, I, look, I, J Joker, and, like, I, I gotta, like, the thing that, that stopped my, the, all the attacks is, I got a thing. It's like, I, I, like, you know how, like, in TV shows, you know, people get shot and they get right back up? Uh-huh. I that's, a, that's what I got. Like, anytime there's anything that goes on, like, that's the first thing I put up. Like, that's why I wasn't too bothered by, like, people coming through and, like, you know, doing things. Like, you know, like, it's, unless, like, the first bit's the, I'm, I, I, I'm protected, you know? My mom got hit, like, a couple times, but, like, you know... We're under the spell, and you know, like I mean, she, I mean, he sort of like pulls up his shirt, you know, and you see where there's wilts on his body. Mm -hmm. Like oh, that's the time, like they they got me, like you know, man. If I hadn't been so quick on it, oh, that could have been a mess. All right, these people have to die. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Like, they could shoot us all they want, but they're shooting potatoes and his sweet old mom. No, they're dead now. They're yeah, dead. No, they shoot. They shoot mama. They shoot mama, they go down. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's, why, that's why I wanted, like, to, us to meet back up there so I could make sure that, like, I, I was, like, pr there to protect her. We, we could well, maybe she needs your mom. Um, 
She'll just have to come here. Oh, she's not going to come here. She's not going to leave her house. Like, Have you considered the fact that maybe Peter was the one putting her in danger? And now that he's not there, she'll be fine? Seems like a pretty big risk to take. About... They're going after people that are charging. If he's not there charging, they have no reason to be there. Well, yeah, we... but what if they keep shooting the house and there's nothing there to protect her? She doesn't know. We we burned. They down... don't know he's gone. We burned down Sydney's mom's house for a reason. Very You're not burning down house. my house. Like no. Fuck you, dude. I'm not saying we're burning your house down. I'm just I'm just saying like it... And why'd you bring it up? I was about to say, Darren, that sounds a lot like you're saying we should burn his house down. I'm just saying Do that... you think she'd be open to going on a vacation? All expenses paid. Wherever. Oh. No. She she gets worried about me when she goes on vacation. Let's make sure I'm eating right, you know? Oh my god. Well, we can make sure you eat right. Uh, yeah. Unless, uh, oh no, you'd have to convince her. What does she think's been happening when she gets shot and doesn't die? Um, I mean, I don't want to like, uh, like, you know, like, uh. They missed. Something else hit her. You know? And she just rolls with that? I mean, yeah. Like, you don't really want her here either. She's not, like, the biggest fan of, like, people, let's just say. People, <laughs> different people. Is mm. uh, uh, I get it. Mm. <laughs> uh. I mean, she's old and Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that too. You couldn't be convinced to go visit family in Asia or something. I mean, I mean, I mean, do, 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 like, have you seen the world? Like, are, are you not familiar with what's going on here? Like, yeah, no, no, I'm a little fine. occupied. Okay, I just don't want her to die. I mean, do you just think we can like get on a plane and travel back to Asia? I like... think I can get you on a plane that will go to Asia. <laughs> What about uh, domestic? Huh? I mean, are you referring to the whole COVID situation? Yeah. Well, the panorama. Private jets and grease bombs have a way of dealing with things. Is he just? I mean, I mean, fuck you, money. I, I don't, I, I don't money. know. Like you know, like like like. <laughs> Japan so and those countries are really locked down. Like, just no don't way eat bats. Just what? Yeah. Just donate what? bats. Just donate masks. Just uh, no uh, bats. Uh, yeah. Oh ways. bats. Oh oh, don't hey. eat. Okay, hey, I heard hey, you correctly hey, this hey, time. Hey 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 hey. Look, I'm not saying. I'm not saying we don't eat weird things, but you know. Some of it's pretty tasty, okay? All right? Okay. I'm just saying, you don't want to get COVID, don't eat bats. That's not... I swear <laughs> to God. That's not... Okay, not honey. Moving on. We're, moving on. Moving on. There's a lot of things. <laughs> Is there anywhere in the United States that she hasn't wanted to go? Is there... Anywhere. Yeah, home. 
She, no. she wants to go other, home. Other, other. Click D, potato, fill in your own answer. It did. She wants to go home. She likes being no. home. Well, I guess after this, you're just going to have to go back then. I don't know. There's no good answer here. I mean, we could have somebody there for, like, extra protection. But I don't know what good that's I mean, going to do. It's not like you need it. <laughs> you know? Like, sounds like it can't really hurt you guys, but it still sounds really dangerous. Oh, it hurts. It, it really fucking hurts. God. <laughs> <laughs> Like, it's like yeah. being punched at the speed of a gunshot, all right? Yeah. Know the feeling. Um, <laughs> what about, like, kidnapping her as nicely as possible? I don't know. I don't know when that worked out for any. It doesn't ever, but you know, right. I don't know. It's an idea. I'll give you that. That's a good, that's an idea. We just need to get her preferably out of New Orleans, if possible. Is she an avatar like you're an avatar? I mean, yeah, like I learned that from her. Like, she taught me how to cook. Like, it's one of the things we share, and I love it, and it's great. And I love my mom. I'll do anything to protect her. She's stubborn. <laughs> and, and and I and it's not like I can just go to her and tell her, you know. What are you gonna do? Like, cause, cause then she's she 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 gets in about like me going back to school and all that other stuff, and I keep trying to tell her that school's not important, and that never comes out properly. Like, she just doesn't get it. Like, you know, I'm learning everything I need to know through these. <laughs> the anime. Yeah. Oh, but uh, oh man, I mean, what is like, what is like college gonna teach me that I can't learn from my hero academia? All right, so many <laughs> things, dude. So many chemistry. <laughs> Oh no! There's an anime about that. Like, you no. Know. <laughs> Is there a United Nations anime? We don't talk about that one. <laughs> we don't talk about that one. No, no, no. And she's like waving a finger at Izzy. Like, no, 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 no. I mean, I mean, we don't I mean, bring I up mean, that flashback. I mean, what can't I learn? Like, about like, what? What am I supposed to learn in a history class that I can't learn from watching Hitalia? You know, a lot of things. N doubt it. Doubt it. Mm. Okay. Anyway, who's Erica? You, you know who Erica is. I mean, I know it's just her so name. Funny we don't. You know, you know who the bitch is. Dude, you can't tell me the Joker did not tell you about the bitch. He the mentioned Regina and Erica in passing, but you have to understand. Trying to have Jake explain you to you, yeah, like, he's terrible at fucking detail? explaining. And I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. <laughs> True, he's an asshole. He can't explain things. He's a fucking moron. God damn it! God damn! It. He didn't tell you why? Why? Why does this come up? Is she in contact with you? Have you talked to her? Has Grace come up to you? Do you know where Grace is? Like, you know? No. 
I, I don't know where Gravy is. Well, fuck her! Fuck her! Who needs her? That bitch can run hell, alright? <laughs> would, would, would you care explaining to us? Oh, no. <laughs> they, they are bitches, alright? Oh, my God. Huge bitches. Erica fucked over Skinner after he saved her ass. And uh, and Skinner and, and Gravy showed her true fucking colors by betraying us and going over to her goddamn team. Okay? You know what? You think she's nice. You think she's nice when she saves your best friend from a psycho bitch. But you know what? She's just as twisted as all the rest of them. The rest of who? Uh, the burger bitches. Uh, the queen right, bitches. Right. <laughs> so, so Erica is part of the burger bitches? Yeah. Yeah. That's, she that's sold out her values. Had. She sold out her friends for what? Yes, for what? Exactly. Yeah, exactly what I want to know. Yes, say the words. Oh, you. Oh, okay. For apparently, a uh, a uh, a slice of whatever the fuck Erica's cooking up. All right. So as fascinating as discussing everyone's exes is, are we going to talk about <laughs> the internet creeper? Yes. The internet creeper is, 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 wait, 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 is, 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 is the dude back? Like that dude who was like sending you guys messages and things? No, no. he told us that he was leaving town. He doesn't have, hasn't done anything since then. So fingers crossed he actually did leave town. But anyway, we're trying to talk to Crypto Grandpa. And when Skinner reached out to him for the first time, his reply was, nice try, Erica. Yep. H hence why dude's we want to based. know who, the, who Erica is. Dude's based, dude's based if, he's, if he's telling Erica to fuck off. Who's Crypto Grandpa again? Um, <laughs> Aoife goes, I have some things. And Izzy goes, um, he's like a mechanomancer who used to work for the Max, we think. It. Wait, like, you know, like Superconductor? That's what I thought! Eva says in the background. And Izzy goes, who? <laughs> Superconductor. Like, he was the big guy. He, he, he's the, he's one of the persons who started Max. Like, he and a couple other people, but those people got killed, like, really quickly. And he's the one who kept it all together. Superconductor is... He's like a legend. But he's dead. When the boards failed and everything like that, there was rumors that, that he got got by a bunch of affinities in, uh, in like, in the Midwest somewhere. But was there ever actual proof or was it just rumors? I don't know. Like, it was during the Whisper War. Like, everything was, like, crazy back then, apparently. It was, it was before well, my time, really, but, you know. Maybe it's his student using one of his old names. Maybe. 
suppose crazier things have happened. Like, I'm, oh shit. Feel like a TV show. He's back from the fucking dead. <gasps> Gotta be him. It makes sense. It makes sense in the universe. All right. He faked his death, and now he's gonna come back. Oh. Eva says, um, was the story that he ended up, um, hooking up with his TNI hitter? Something like that. Yeah, Wait, we're trying to reach out incredible. to someone in TNI. No. The rumor goes that he flipped someone from TNI who was sent to kill him. That that would be that would be something, but but that was the upheaval when when TNI fell the fuck apart. Wait, TNI fell apart? Yeah. Rumor on the street: someone big up in TNI double crossed the big man, nearly killed him. Huh. These events seem unlikely to be unlinked. Shit. <laughs> fucking superconductor. Turning it on Alex fucking Abel. Dude. Anyway, um, we also know that there's at least one new Burger King operative in town, which is no fun. Another what? bitch. <laughs> Godiva got Godiva got shot up by a defector Cleomancer. <sighs> Shit! Did I have okay? Yeah, she's good. She's over there. Oh. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Cat just like you, you see Cat glare at him. He's like, "What?" <laughs> I'm fine, potatoes. Thank you. Cinderella's perfectly fine. <laughs> Oh, are you two together? Oh, sorry, sorry. No, no. But nice. <laughs> Cat, you just oh like, I will. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Anyone need any further explanations? I mean, I mean, I'm not up. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not opposed to it. Cat just like just gives him a glare, like, "All right, fine, all right, later." No. <laughs> oh, apparently she wants. Apparently she wants to know now. Cat gives you a look, Tilly. What? No death glares. It's fine. Yeah, I've I've confused myself apparently. <laughs> What's Mercedes Please. doing? Is all. All right. If we're not doing anything important, I have things cooking. You're cooking. All right. What you making? No. <laughs> <laughs> Drugs. Wrong cooking. Oh. <laughs> what you making? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> e? E? No class. <laughs> oh, we're like, we're like making a party? It's always a party. All right. Mercedes, don't corrupt the tiny nerd. Don't do it. No. I need you to roll me lie. 
Wait, who? I was correcting. I was. I was verifying something with Steph about uh, inconsistent information, and it turned out she's just lying to him. So, uh, oh, okay. she needs to roll me lie. Looks like he goes. All right. Okay. <clears throat> Why you want to buy some? <laughs> no, I think I'm good. All right. Suit yourself. Um, Joe. So. <laughs> Izzy's gonna ask Pete if he wants to stay here or go home, and she'll try to make it work either way. I mean, I mean, if you guys can get, if you guys can convince my mom to stay here, it's fine, you know. I just think it's gonna, you know, take a while, take a bit of doing. Until then, I should probably stay with her. I mean, I'm, I mean, I, mean, I don't want to see her get hurt. I mean, I don't think any of us want that, but you're probably going to have to stop charging for a little bit. I can't do that. I, if I stop charging, then the only thing that's keeping us safe is me charging. Like... <laughs> you're not holding anything? Oh, I'm holding a, sh I'm holding a shit ton. But, like, you know, I I need to be able to drop it on a dime. Okay. But but right. but fair. If if they start realizing that I'm I'm protected here and they have a no, then I mean, I suppose there's nothing stopping them from coming in and shutting it all down. The next time they do it. I think nothing is suggested to us that they've got more than the one and he's or she or they, as the case may be, have been trying to not give away any information about themselves. Because we are pretty sure that it's a they. Might have forgotten to tell you that detail. We think the Nullamancer no. is also a Rebus. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey. Rebus is is that's the magical one, isn't it? Yeah, we think it's a worse freak. A different freak. Weren't we gonna break someone out of jail? Oh yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Yes. Break yeah, we were gonna do that. Oh, you guys are gonna need me for that. Oh, yeah. Hang out. Hang out. Okay. Who's convincing? I mean, I could go and talk to her. <laughs> I give it a shot. I can give it a shot. It's whatever. There... <laughs> no. Probably, probably not no. the best person. But, but no. <laughs> no. <laughs> No. Right. Eastern Eterge, sit. 
Uh, Alright, somebody <laughs> wants to go convince Peter's mom to come here. Yes. Yes. And possibly save all of us with cooking. <laughs> yeah! I mean, except Mercedes. Like, she's still gonna be I cooking. mean, I can try and help, but I can't make any promises. We could also just go in one by one and one of us sway in the car. And the next one, I'm going to be like, look, please, for the love of God. I've only got a couple doses of Jupiter X. We're not oh dosing. God. We're not. We're not. Dosing mother no. potatoes. <laughs> no. We're not drugging his mom. Yeah. No. What the and fuck the do you guys take me for? <laughs> not for her. <laughs> for who? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I only roofied Izzy once. We don't talk about it. Oh, okay. Jupiter X makes you really friendly and everyone likes you. That's valid. Kind of. What else does it do? <laughs> it's always a catch. What's the catch? What do you mean, what else does it do? Does it do other things? Am I going to be so high that I can't function to talk to this woman? Oh my god. I didn't even consider that part. Can you normally not talk to people when you're on E? No, well, I think I'm really good at it, but you'd have to tell me, dear. <laughs> because I was on E. <laughs> yes, everyone is your friend while you're on ecstasy. Don't do drugs. Oh don't my do drugs. Please, God. please don't do drugs. <laughs> Does this mean drugs I bad. get to see Isabel, the miracle worker, high as shit? <laughs> she doesn't know everything about me. Okay? <laughs> I may have kept some aspects of my life separate from each other. She thinks that it would be unusual for me to be high as balls. <laughs> yes. Oh, sweetie. Once they open the clubs back up, you're coming out with us. But that's okay, because you've never watched me do my calculus homework either. So, um... You did your homework. Oh my god. Yes! You were there! You made me! <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. <clears throat> okay. How about Haley and I go try to talk to, to Mama? And, uh, We'll see how it goes. Let's do it. All right, I'm gonna go. Um, Pete. Yeah? Does your mom like Jake? I mean, like... Like is a strong word. Uh, just hate him. Okay. So not really a selling point then. I mean, like she knows he's my friend, and uh, 
Uh, she refrains from saying things negative about him in English. Uh, <laughs> in <laughs> English. Oh my. <laughs> I see. Fair enough. You have to remember that, like, uh, Jake is kind of an asshole, and, uh, I've had to tell him to not be an asshole to my mom. Uh. Well, yes, but seeing as you guys are best friends, I sort of assumed that that might have happened a long time ago, and he might have been relatively chill. I mean, then. yeah, but, like, he, he has, but my mom is, let's just say, uh... Not the forgive-and-forget how... type? Yeah. <laughs> she'll, she'll, she's sweet and kind and nice to anyone, but boy, does she know how to keep a, a grudge. Gotcha. He, she still can't stand, uh, uh, she doesn't like Skinner because she thinks he's British. And, uh, she <laughs> still blames them for the opium wars. Oh my. Skinner's not British. He looks British. He <laughs> looks British. She keeps saying. Do I look British? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's wrong with people. Opium's great. No. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Not to a little Asian woman, apparently. And, you know, several other professionals in various fields. So what tack do we take? I don't know. Um, be Asian? Be Asian. <laughs> <laughs> Potatoes, look at this, people. Look, look, look at us. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. All right. As he starts drumming her fingers on the table and then goes, mm. <laughs> I nudge Tilly. Oh. Hold on. What? <laughs> Can't read. What do you mean, what? Hold up, I'm trying to read the thing. I couldn't make that out. I said, hold up, I'm trying to read the thing, but I realized I'm reading the wrong thing anyway. Oh, okay. Hold on. I have so many things. Hold on. I'm sorry. I I could... I could... It feels racist saying pretend to be Asian. And I don't know how to do that. I could just smooch her. Yeah, you're not the only I... one capable of pretending to be Asian, but I just decided not to bring it up. <laughs> I don't know. I'm I... trying to get the fuck up. I can't be Asian, okay? <laughs> I can't do that. I room can be Asian except for the people who are Asian. <laughs> yeah, I don't think... <laughs> That's the problem. If Mother Lotang wants us to be Asian, we have a predicament. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I can't pretend to be Asian. I can make a lot of smoke and see and tell. <laughs> no, that falls in line with the kidnapping plan, and I thought we were doing that. At least to me, that falls in line with the kidnapping part.
Did you find what you were looking for, Tilly? No, because I'm looking in the wrong book. I am sorry. Hold hold on. I know I know where they are. There's two books where my things are. Sorry, RP amongst yourself. <laughs> <laughs> So, what's the, what are the rest of us doing while they go talk to Miss Potatoes about leaving her home? Don't call her Mrs. Potatoes, Darren. <laughs> <laughs> That's the surefire way not to get her to go with us. Well, I've listed her as me, Mama Potatoes Lotang. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Mama potatoes. Mama potatoes. Yeah. Where are? Where? Where? Yeah. Don't. 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 Don't call her. Don't. Don't call Tommy potatoes in front of her. That's a. You know. I'm Peter. You know. <laughs> not Pete either. Oh yeah, not Pete. Uh, uh you can call me Pay. Uh, but, uh, I wouldn't. Oh, is it like Peter's your American name or something? I've known a, a Thai woman whose name was Lily, but her actual name was not Lily. I wish that was a joke. I'm so sorry. I'm just asking because I thought about it. Uh, you think it'll take an hour? <laughs> What? Why? Uh, because I just get a charge out of it. <laughs> Mayhaps you think? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I, it's, it's, I suppose it's going to take as long as it's going to take. Oh, I'm a dumbass. No, you're not. What happened? Cat. Cat, please come and help us to talk to this woman. It's going. Why? Because you're um, a thingy. You're good you're at thingy. reasoning. Oh. You're a demagogue. That's the one. Fine, I'll go talk to her. Me and Potatoes will go and we'll talk to her and convince her into coming. Fine. Do you want any of us to come? No, it's fine. Something about this combo doesn't scream, invite my mother to stay with me. But I guess if you guys think that'll work better than me going in there and he pretending. He glares at you. I'm just saying. I didn't say it was bad. I just feel like Izzy's more the type that you take home to mom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. No, we're not. We're not That's insulting. <laughs> I have never been taken home to anyone. <laughs> I didn't Ever. say it. <laughs> I take it home to mom. She's just far away. I know. I know. No one's taking me home to their mother. So what are y'all belly aching about? <laughs> anyway, uh, Kat is gonna head out to, my mom. <laughs> to to talk and to talk Peter's uh, mom after you know probably several hours long conversation <laughs> while he washes things and keeps them all safe. Uh, to convince her about things and that she can do stuff and maybe to be a little less racist. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Doing uh, good work, yeah. Making yeah. the world a better place. Yeah. 
<laughs> one brainwashing session at a time. <laughs> yep. Anyway. <laughs> uh, but no, uh, so uh, uh, word is going to come back from Skinner. Uh, he's he's convinced Crypto Gra uh, Crypto Grandpa is at least willing to have a conversation with you guys digitally before he shows up. All right. Okay, that's a good one. Yeah, that's progress. All right. He has it all set up. If you guys are uh, wanting to go in. Yeah. And do that? Yeah, let's talk to Crypto Grandpa. Alright. I'm assuming I can get some work in while they're off talking to Mrs. Potatoes. Yeah, yeah no, you guys, you can definitely get some work in while they're off doing these things. Uh, it's like... Right, you're brought into there. There's a computer set on up uh, with a uh, a client going. Yes. All right. Hawk. You can see the computer voice on the other end. Uh, it is a fully digital voice. Or at least it's a very distorted voice coming through the, the speakers. Is there video? Do we see more? Uh, no, no video. Uh -huh. So you say you're not with Regina? No. And yet you claim that you have some things. I'd like to see proof of that live on camera. Um, is there one set up? Yes. If not, then you guys can set one up with a short amount of time. Okay. Um, so Aoife steps forward. Are, are we sure that this isn't the voice? Stop it, bitch. I hate that. That's an idea now. Yeah, I hate that. I'm just saying. I mean, technically not, but the chances that an Elemancer wants to talk about major charge devices seems pretty Magic low. Magic is real. It is. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> so I doubt that they would taboo themselves for the mere purposes of buying on a slightly better than he does all the time. Anyway. Crypto Grandpa. I'm also a mechanomancer and she's gonna pull Charlotte out. We yeah, recently nice not little little uh little amateurish, but uh I mean I mean we all gotta I've start only... somewhere. I've only been at it for six months and doing my best. Like I said, I, I, I I'm not I'm not trying to I'm I'm trying to give you compliments, alright? <laughs> Thank you. Anyway. Hit up a museum. Managed to score some stuff. Um That's what I hear. You guys are the ones responsible for the watch museum robbery. Who knows? Yes. Everyone's fucking talking about that, you know? That's probably uh, not a good thing, but we oh, need yeah, to no. get what they're gonna done. <laughs> yeah, no, um, uh, from what I'm able to hear, uh, uh, the, uh, Sleepers and T&I are all snooping all over that, you know? Oh. My. <sighs> God. Uh, well, let's hope they only run into each other. It's alright. We clean up after ourselves. I mean, I mean, they're going to get your accomplice, I think. <laughs> what? Who? The guard. The security guard you worked with. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh. that, uh, you know, that stuff happens. <laughs> oh, you're, you're, 
you're not uh, is he like you know you're making sure he's not gonna like sell you out like how what, you got something on him we took care of it all right i mean it's sure fine it's fine we'll deal with it either way anyway to deal with our current problem the voice we're trying to put together a book of some of the knowledge that the Max had. And although we've got a good portion of the list, we think that there's more that we could add. I mean, yeah, I've got a shit ton of stuff just that I can remember, and I could give you a whole lot more. But yeah, no, I'm going to need to make sure you guys have the goods. Um, Aoife will bring out the intact major charge device. All right. And very carefully put it down, and she has to try very hard to leave it there. <laughs> that does look promising. Does it work? Yes. Show me. It's functional and ready. Show Please, me. someone else, open the damn watch case. I don't want to touch it again. I'll do or it. I really want to touch it again. I just Either want to way. Until I opens the watch case. Okay, you, 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 you wind it up and goes, Perfect. How many of these do you have? This is the only one that's only. in functional condition. Well, you have others that are not in functional condition? We came away with some other things. All right. And that's mine if I if I agree to help you. Yes. All right. Could take some time. I might need to make some arrangements, you know. Make sure my stuff here is all settled before I, you know, can get out there. Traveling is is difficult, but uh, we can send you a plane. <laughs> Probably no, no. I'm not gonna, you know. A, uh, I have ways, and B, I'm not giving you my location, uh, in case you are just, you know some other rat. Uh, I've dodged him before, and I'm gonna keep dodging him, uh, and I'm not gonna let you put me into, you know, some kind of fucking cage. Alright? Not that, like, I don't trust you, but, like, you know, I've learned my lesson. No. I've been burned way too many times. Alright? I understand. I think. We'll wait for you to contact us then. Sure, give me your location. <clears throat> uh, Izzy looks around to the group. Any objections? No. I mean, we already got one crazy person after us, so what's another? I was supposed to say I have a slight one, but, like, can't really do anything about it, so. Yes, but we're also protected, which is why That's it's fair. more okay. Yeah, sure. No arguments for me. All right. A few uh, hours, a, a few days pass, I'm going to say. Uh, is there anything that you guys would like to do in that time? Smoke a lot of cigarettes. You yeah, know, you can totally smoke Jesus. a lot of cigarettes. Um, uh, How many days? Uh, we're going to say three days pass. Till he get a phone. <laughs> yes, till he has a phone. <laughs> I get a phone. Mm -hmm. Nice. Uh, uh, 
Pete's grandmother, uh, Pete's mother is is totally moving in uh, to a little place over there, but she is definitely wanting to keep her space and to have her place and, you know, you, you know, be hers and stuff. By a little place over there, do you mean like one of the apartments in the building or do you yeah. mean oh, got gotcha. apartment okay. in the building? Well, I mean, unless you have unless you have some other area that they can put her in that's not in the apartment buildings that uh, is there, then she'd take that. You know, she wants, you know, because she's given up like a small house. She doesn't want to downgrade to an apartment necessarily. But, you know, Kat can convince her to do basically anything. So. Uh, <laughs> given enough time. Are we including the 19th and the three days or three days after that? Uh, including the 19th and the three days. Okay. How so much... Is there anything could, else that you... How, yeah. much, how much could I reasonably charge for that amount of time? How sick do you want to be? I mean... Oh, God. I mean, not not terribly sick. Um, I'm willing to get a little sick, though. I just want, want to be able to, like, sleep reasonably. Like, you know... Oh, no. You are not able to sleep reasonably. Uh, I mean, you know, I can wake up every couple Don't hours. Don't worry, Darren. I think I got the dose right this no, time. No, no, it's okay. I'm good. <laughs> yeah, it's I just know. three Fuck. days of pure, Fuck. unadulterated science. Fuck your shitty street drugs. Um, I've had enough of that, I think. Uh, no, I mean, just how much could I reasonably? Like, without, like, trying to kill myself or anything. About an hour a day, I suppose. How many how many hours in a day are you smoking? I mean, I'm, if I'm obsessed. I mean, with it. I think people regularly smoke a carton a day. Not a yeah. carton. <laughs> not, not a carton's like. Oh 10, God, a carton. Ten Jesus, packs that's of an cigarettes. Actual, like box. I mean, I've known smokers who smoke <laughs> oh, like no. two packs a day. You know, I've known smokers who smoke a... one pack a day or half a pack a day. Um, but I think I've heard of a patient smoking five a day. Oh. Oh. Yeah, you see a lot of shit when you work in healthcare for a while. Um, but I mean, you know, like once every thirty minutes at least, probably. Like if I'm really trying to charge, and I kind of am. Yeah. Which would put me at about. You know, assuming I'm sleeping, laying down <laughs> eight hours a day, that leaves me with 16. That's 32 cigarettes a day. That's a pack and a half. All right. Hey, Darren. Hey. Can I have a pack of cigarettes? Hell no. Why are you asking? You hate cigarettes. I'm suspicious just because you're asking. Science. <laughs> Fuck yeah, science. You can get a pack at like the store though, right? Like so, um, uh, days these. pass, and eventually, uh, there is a knock on uh, your guys's door. Looking through the peephole. You don't see anything. Oh, God. All right. We're going to slowly open the door. Sure. You slowly, carefully, uh, Carefully open the door, and on the other side of the door is... Is it a robot? No. Damn it.
this. Oh god, it's ter it's terrifying. Yeah. Looks to be like a 14-year-old girl. Well, she's definitely here to kill us all. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Four dollars a box. <laughs> Izzy, get your cash. <laughs> she's got Girl Scout cookies. <laughs> <laughs> Oh what are you God. guys actually doing? <sighs> May we help you? Um, I'm here to see the one called Aoife. That's me. All right. Crypto Grandpa. Uh... And that's where I think we'll cut the session. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh 14 year old girl shows up at your place claiming to be crypto grandpa <laughs> uh, I wanted to say something oh, what well, do you want to say then. sure um I take it Superconductor did die. Is this his, like... His demon. Yup. In inhabiting oh. the body of a 14-year-old girl. Ah. I was right. She's gonna kill all of us. I kind of hate that. <laughs> this yeah. ends. That's what I said. It's like, I'll send a plane. He's like, I'm not gonna fucking... No. <laughs> <laughs> Just to put this meat suit on it? No. <laughs> yeah, when he said the um, thing about having a way of traveling and that he didn't want to end up in a cage, Aoife definitely um, had a teeny tiny little flinch because she was thinking, I can make a demon cage, and he knows I can make a demon cage. <laughs> Demon cage. He knows that he can make a demon cage. With the thing you have, he can make himself a demon body. Uh, uh, a, a body. Uh, I didn't think demons could usually use magic. Uh, okay, fair. Uh, he, 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 it's, it's he fair. can he, get he me to make him a body. <laughs> yeah, he can get you to make him a body. And he's gonna inspect that shit. Like, you know, nobody's <laughs> business. Uh, the problem that you're going to have is the 14-year-old girl suddenly waking up in your room. He's probably going to watch you make that shit. No, I'm sure that he will be backseat making it until Aoife seriously considers it would make her less insane to just allow herself to be possessed. <laughs> <laughs> she probably won't do it, but still. It worked, so, it worked out so well last time. But, uh, but no, uh, I hope everyone enjoyed the session. I hope you uh, liked the uh, introduction of uh, Crypto Grandpa <laughs> and uh, more information. Yeah. Yeah. Tune in next week where we will hear more about the secrets of Crypto Grandpa and the mysteries will unfold. Uh, <laughs> Right on. <clears throat> also, again, tomorrow, uh, because we normally don't do this, tomorrow, uh, tune over at uh, A Wise Man uh, once for uh, some uh, lovely Changeling the Lost. Uh, we have some things going on over there. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Probably not murdering a dude this time. Yeah. Actually, I think that's the thing you're doing, isn't it? It's the murder a dude thing. Ah! That was the plan. You murder a dude. Watch, come over and watch them murder a dude, alright? <laughs> or try to murder a dude. You might be tricky. I just want to point out, this was not my idea this time. No. <laughs> no. Right on. Well, 
Well, it's twitch.tv slash man once, right? Mm-hmm. Yes, it is. Check it out. Indeed. Um, yeah. And, uh, of course, Monday here we on Rambling Man TV, we got Force of Flesh. Then Tuesday is broken, and we're doing an episode. We're on episode five. I think we're on episode five, uh, which means uh, epi- or second giveaway will be done. Um, so we had the winner of the first giveaway. It was Team Zach. Um, we'll be doing the drawing for the second giveaway on Tuesday. And the third one will be a week from Tuesday for episode six. I can't. And, 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 and of course, I can't be there because I'm running my own game. <laughs> Defiant. We're getting uh, ready to start that up. Right on. on Who's beating so, advertising? Yes. So you can you can watch something like Broken, or you can watch a game about <laughs> gods and angels and demons trying to uh, run the world after the apocalypse that uh, my players caused. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Totally watch yeah. Broken. Watch dirty little gremlin ladies and other weird freaks go on a there's, amazing there's adventure. Anime. There's yeah. anime Dirty Gremlin Lady on this channel, and on the other channel, there is Chaos Gremlin anime ladies. Check your voice. <laughs> Maybe uh, on Broken Tuesday, we'll figure out what split that guy's, that naked guy's head open from the inside. Oh shit, he was naked? <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, well, that is that is quite a thing to do. Uh, uh, I, I am, uh, I am just going to say that this is I am a wise man once, and you've been watching uh, uh, Rambling Man TV, where a wise man once said, uh, uh, "Defiant, uh, all the way, go for it." <laughs> oh, speaking of games, are we pen dragoning next weekend or not? We should be pen dragoning next weekend. I don't have to cry. Yeah. Caitlin can cry instead. It's fine. No, that's not no, what it's I do. Fine. Enjoy your convention. <laughs> I mean, I mean, in all, in all honesty, your character being in the situation that they are in makes perfect sense. Uh, you skipping the next thing and just doing healing stuff. Uh, He may have gotten a little bit one HP. Almost dead. Almost <laughs> yeah. dead. Oh, if I had rolled more damage, if I had rolled more damage on that uh, crossbow bolt, uh, it rolled under the amount of damage I believe that it normally would have dealt. Uh, if I had rolled uh, under that, because I rolled, I rolled a six, I think, on a two d six. So uh, seven is the. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, so uh so. cross the bolts, then you fell off a horse because you fell unconscious, and then uh yeah. But he lives, so he I lives. win. Yes. <laughs> you survive. Just like how Darren nearly died of a drug overdose. Nearly. Because yeah. Steph was like matched failure. And I'm like, that's a matched failure. <laughs> Alright, we're going with it. <clears throat> Yep. Here you go, Darren. <laughs> You're the one who's going to pay for my sins. Not me. <laughs> I saved him from dying. Yes, fair. No, he saved himself from dying. He, 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 he rolled the fitness so he didn't just actually start dying. I was like, well... You made his suffering a little more, uh, uh, uh... Manageable? Oh, no, less manageable. She made him awake for it. Oh, God. <laughs> Listen, if he's awake, he's not dead. You're right. No. Yeah. <laughs> she put him into a more painful state where he had to be conscious yeah. and in pain instead of, well, you know, passed out and in pain. <laughs> you know what? He chose to take the drugs. That's he his problem. He did. He did. He did it. That is, that is his thing. Right. Yep. It was your idea, Haley. Or no, Tilly. It was Tilly. It was Tilly's idea. Yeah, it was not my idea. Try again. <laughs> I'm, 
I'm sorry. I started the situation. Don't be, don't Almost be sorry. died again, Darren. Don't be sorry. I would have totally done it anyways. Uh, I'm not sorry. <laughs> I am also you know, not silly, sorry that I am not using not. you as my guinea pig. It's always <laughs> you, and I love it. <sighs> <laughs> Well, what can I say? Darren is a glutton for self-punishment, I guess. Uh, One of these days, I'm going to do something really awesome to you, though. <laughs> that worries me. <laughs> Sounds super threatening and yep. sexual at the same time. That's terrifying. That's the stuff of my nightmares. <laughs> All right. Well, on that note, thanks for watching. Oh, uh, <laughs> Sex, drugs, and New Orleans. Uh, and always, yeah. great, always great yeah. playing with you guys. And have a great week. We'll see you guys next week, a week from today, not two weeks from today, a week from yeah, today. Yeah, a whole week. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, have a good night, folks. Good night. Good night.